Before there was Lady Gaga, before there was even Madonna, there was Eva Tangway. And today she is number 228 on our list of the top 250 Canadians. So let's learn a bit about her story. Born in Marmelton, Quebec on August 1st, 1878, Eva Tangway would suffer the passing of her father at only the age of six. At eight, she would appear on stage for the first time, sparking a career that would continue for the rest of her life. By the turn of the century, Tangway was touring professionally, and her appearance in The Chaperones in 1904 started her rise to fame. In 1905, she starred in The Sambo Girl, where she debuted the song I Don't Care, which would become her signature song. That same year, she was touring vaudeville as a solo act. By 1910, Tangway had reached the height of her fame, pulling in $3,500 per week, or $90,000 per week in 2022 funds. Alistair Crowley would see her perform and call her the perfect artist and chaste in her colossal corruption. Tangway understood how to make publicity, and she spent lavishly on publicity campaigns and costumes, sometimes spending twice her salary on publicity. She also knew how to get free publicity, which she did through her relationships with prominent men. As for her costumes, they were described as extravagant as her personality. In 1910, when the Lincoln Penny was first issued, she appeared on stage in a coat covered completely in the pennies. Unfortunately, she would lose more than $2 million in the 1929 stock market crash, equivalent to $30 million today. And by the 1930s, she had retired from show business and was slowly going blind. She would pass away on January 11th, 1947, in Hollywood. So that was Eva Tangway. Who's going to be number 227? Tune in next time.